Hey, welcome to my channel. Are you an Etsy seller looking to boost your sales? Well, you've come to the right place. In today's video, I'm sharing with you my three top tips to help you increase your sales by 50% and take your Etsy business to the next level. So sit back, grab a notebook, and let's get started on taking your Etsy business to the next level. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications to never miss a video. Let's get started. Tip number one, you want to optimize your listing titles. The first step to increasing your sales on Etsy is by optimizing your listing titles. Your titles are the first thing that potential buyers will see when they come across <coughs> excuse me, your listing. So it's important that they're clear, concise, and include relevant keywords. When writing your listing title, make sure to include the most important information about your product. For example, if you're selling a handmade soap, make sure to include the type of soap, the scent, and any other relevant information like packaging or allergies or anything like that. On top of that, you wanna include keywords that people might use when searching for products like yours. It's also important to keep in mind the character limit for your listing titles. Etsy allows for 140 characters in the title, so make sure to use them wisely. A good rule of thumb is to keep your title under 80 characters so it's easily readable and doesn't get cut off in the search results when somebody's typing into Etsy. Another thing to keep in mind is to make sure that your titles are not repetitive, boring, or generic. Be creative, be catchy, and make your listings really stand out. On top of that, it's also a good idea to include any relevant details like the materials used in your product, any unique features, and the dimensions of the product is also very important. This is gonna help buyers to get a better idea of what they're buying and increase the chances of them actually making the purchase, which is what we want, right? So optimizing your listing titles is simple, yet effective in a way to increase visibility and drive more sales on Etsy. So by following that tip, you'll be well on your way to boosting your sales and taking your Etsy business to the next level. So take some time to review your current listing titles, make sure they're optimized and keep that tip in mind when creating new listings. Your sales will definitely thank you, guaranteed. Tip number two, excuse me, <coughs> got a cold today. Use high quality images. The next step to increasing your sales on Etsy is always, always, always use high quality images. Your images are the second thing that potential buyers will see after your listing title. So it's important that they are clear, well lit, and show your product in the best possible light. Don't take pictures in the dark, that never works at all. When taking a picture of your product, make sure to use natural light and a neutral background. This will help, <coughs> excuse me, your product stand out and be the main focus of the image. Avoid using flash, or like really overly filtered images as they can make your product look unnatural and unappealing. It's also important to use multiple images for each listing. They have 10 spots, use them. This will give buyers a better idea of what the product looks like from different angles and will increase the chances of them actually making a purchase when they, have, they can see more options. You also wanna make sure that your images are large enough to be easily viewed Etsy recommends that they're at least 2,000 pixels wide on the longest side or height. So that way they appear clear and crisp on the website. And when you are doing something at 2,000 pixels wide, even in a program like Canva or something like that, that will boost up the, the uh, DPI to like 300 automatically. So uh, like a 72 DPI image is not as clear and concise as something that's at like 300 DPI. So an easy way to increase your um, quality of your picture is just make it bigger. And then when you take it at the bigger setting, when you zoom it down, it's gonna be crystal clear. So um, another thing to keep in mind is that you can also use a video of your product in action. And this is a great way to showcase your product and give buyers a better idea of what they're actually purchasing. And Etsy themselves actually encourages you to do this Whenever you upload your product, you'll see that there's a little blue box there right below the images. And it always says like, our studies show how um, listings with videos do a lot better than listings without them. And like, I'm talking about taking a video of somebody using it, but if you're in the print on demand world, 
you can use a program like Canva again to create a simple video. And it could literally be just three seconds of like image one, three seconds, image two, three seconds, image three, image four, image five. If you have three second shots that are just cutting quickly, that, that's a total of 15 seconds. And that's really all you need, 15 to 20 seconds tops. You don't need a long video. It's not like YouTube where you're going on there and talking for 10 minutes like I do. Um, it's just short, punchy, quick. And with Canva too, you can add animations so it, it can zoom in and out. It can bounce around the screen. The video can have text going across in like a typewriter fashion. There's a lot of really good things that you can do with video uh, for Etsy. And, and it's super simple to use a program like Canva to do that. If you want me to shoot a, a demo of how to create a video on Canva, let me know in the comments below and I'll be happy to do it for you. All right, so getting back to this, when creating uh, those images, you wanna always consider the customer's perspective. Like what would you like to see before buying a product? What de details would be important to you? So using high quality images is a simple yet effective way to increase your visibility and drive more sales on Etsy. By following that tip alone, uh, you'll be well on your way to boosting your sales and really taking your Etsy business to the next level. So take the time to review your current images, make sure they're high quality and keep these, that tip in mind when you're creating all your new listings. All right, tip number three, utilize tags and categories. The third step to increasing your sales on Etsy is by utilizing tags and categories when it comes to making your product discoverable on Etsy. Tags and categories play a very crucial role. So when creating your listing, you have to use them. Never skip this. The combination of both makes it even more powerful. The, the reason being, it's gonna help buyers find your listing when they're searching for specific items. And it's also increase, going to increase your visibility in the search results. So for example, again, if you're selling like a handmade soap, I keep saying that, but make sure to include tags like soap, handmade, organic, and any other relevant keywords that describe your product. You also want to make sure to choose the appropriate category for your product. So if your product falls under the category of like bath and beauty, make sure to select that category uh, when creating your listing. There are some tools out there too that will help you with uh, generating tags or finding tags. And there's one called Everbee. And I actually have a, a review of Everbee here on my channel. If you search for it, you can find it. It's really good because it'll, it'll, oops, it'll load the page and then you just click on product analysis and it will show you uh, the sales. It's kind of like a guess based on the reviews. And then it'll show you the title and the tag. And the tags are the thing that are really driving uh, all the traffic to that listing. So you wanna get your tags right for your products. And if you're not sure, you know, what should I tag it? Should it be like a long tag or a short tag? I've been experimenting lately with one word tags and they're working pretty well. So might be something that you wanna consider on your listings too. If you're not really getting much traction, try a one, like one word tag instead of like multiple words. And a lot of those tags too, it really depends on how much they get searched on Etsy. So the one word tags will outperform like a multiple word tag um, nine times out of 10, I, I've been finding anyway. Let me know if that's working for you too. So you wanna use a variety of tags too, and don't repeat the same tag multiple times. There's no point. Etsy's search algorithm takes into account the variety that you use, and the more diverse, the better, okay? Another thing to keep in mind is to take advantage of the 13 tags that Etsy allows you per listing. Use them wisely, make sure they're relevant to your product, and always go with 13. Don't go less, you always go with 13. You wanna also do some research, like I said, on popular keywords and hashtags in your niche, and use them in your tags and titles. This will help increase your visibility in the search results. And when you have that, you're gonna drive more sales. So utilizing tags and categories is a simple yet effective way to increase visibility and drive more sales on Etsy. So that tip too is gonna to help boost your sales and it's gonna help you to take your Etsy business to the next level. So you wanna go through and review your current tags and categories, make sure they're optimized and keep these tips in mind when you're creating new listings going forward. So there you have it. Three tips to help you increase your sales on Etsy by 50%. Where did I come up with 50%? Why not? It could be 100%. I hope you found these tips helpful. 
And I hope that um, <coughs> you're ready to take your Etsy business to the next level. Remember, the key to success on Etsy is visibility. And by following these tips, you'll be well on your way to making your products more discoverable and increasing your sales, which is what we all want. If you're looking for more in-depth help and support, be sure to check out my group coaching program at ppc-coach.com. I offer a comprehensive program that covers everything from store creation to marketing strategies and everything in, be in between. Plus, you'll have access to a community of other Etsy sellers who are also working to grow their business. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and never miss a video. And as always, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them in the comments section and I'll be happy to respond to you. I do respond to all my comments too. So thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.